we've got this really sad clip, this really sad picture, this really sad state of affairs that is a real confirmation for all of us out there that the Adidas Samba hype is well and truly over. It, reach, it, it features none other than UK Prime Minister Richie Sunak wearing a, you know, strategically wearing a pair of Adidas Sambas, white ones, with his trousers and his white shirt. It's basically the quintessential business casual. It's quintessential smart casual. It's quintessential Friday night in the office with the lads fucking outfit, right? If you worked in any sort of like office environment where you have to wear smart clothes, usually the Fridays where people kind of, you know, loosen a tie or don't wear a tie or don't wear a blazer and wear the trainers with their fucking suit. And that looks like what he's done here. So it's, so, it's obviously strategically done, but this is the proof if ever you needed it, that the final nail in the coffin has been done with Sambas. The Samba nail in the coffin wasn't all those kids in central London Soho wearing their massive jeans and their oversized jackets and pretending to smoke cigarettes and shit and taking a million fucking street style pictures of themselves. No, those weren't the kids that killed Sambas. Not even Jound, made in Germany, oops, made in Vietnam, Sambas didn't kill fucking the Sambas. Not even JD Sports killed the Sambas. Not even Size, right? Not even Offspring. No one. The ones that killed the fucking Sambas was when the normies got a hold of them. When your regular Beckys and Emmas, which I saw a couple actually the other day. I saw a Becky or an Emma um, on the central line actually. And this girl looked like she had legitimately like a US nine foot like a UK nine, like a men's UK nine foot. And if you know anything about Sambas, you'll know the, the svelte slim profile makes them look really big. If you've got a big foot like me, I'm a US what? I'm a US 12, US 11. So my feet always look fucking gigantic and everywhere, especially because I got wider feet. So when you see a girl that's got really long feet wearing shoes that are really hard to pull off if you have really long feet, it's like, oh my God. And also she was wearing it with some Zara dress. I was like, okay, cool. The Aida Samba hype is dead, but this is definitely the confirmation that we need that Sambas are officially over. If you wear a pair of Sambas now, I pray for you, but it's done. Richie Sunak has got a pair. The fucking lamest, dorkiest guy in the world is wearing a pair of shoes that everyone's kind of creaming over. I can't do it. I can't. So that's why going forward, the only Sambas I'm going to be wearing are the fucking Jown Sambas. I'm going to pay, you know, $400 to wear a pair of fucking Jown. Let's actually see how much they're going for on StockX. But that's the only thing I'm going to do now. No more Sambas for me, GR ones, only the fucking jammed ones because they've got a bit more extra quality on them because I can't be buying those fucking other shitty ones and getting myself in fucking trouble by looking like fucking Richie Sunak. Imagine going to a pub or going out and someone's like, oh shit, you got the Richie Sunaks? Are those the shoes that Richie Sunak has? You're like, fuck off, you know what I mean? I would not take that well. So a pair of jowned Aida Sambas, which are a little bit more luxe. Um, they're allegedly made in Germany, but they're actually made in Vietnam. They're actually going for 300 and what? $300. Let's actually see my size. My size, the last sale was, oh, Jesus Christ, a lot. My size, the last sale was, um, God damn, 367. Or let's say, because if it's a bit narrow, I'd probably get 11.5. No, oh, sorry. I'd probably get a 10.5. Yeah. So 367. God damn it, 367 to get a pair of Ada Sambas that are made in much nicer materials than the one that Richie Sturak is wearing, and they're way more expensive. They're retailing for, or not retailing, but you know, reselling for about $300, $400, which is crazy because those are just the normal ones, right? That's another type of thingy, but yeah, absolutely wild to see um, crazy scenes overall. But again, the Ada Samba hype is over, my friends. The Adidas Samba hype is officially over. I apologize. I really fucking do apologize.